Dear customers, in this video we will explain how to get rid of studently listen.club pop-up windows and they attack primarily Google Chrome and Mozilla Firefox browsers. Frankly speaking, these pop-ups are very similar to a lot of other dangerous websites showing intrusive web push notifications. But the problem is uh, not happening until the people mistakenly start interacting with these alerts. Well, what you see, what you can see on this uh, pop-up is that they have the block and the allow button. And the pop-up tries to do all it can to make you click on the allow button eventually. For instance, it might tell that it's necessary for age verification or for proving that you are not a robot and you are a human or for some other misleading reasons. So, it is dangerous when you click on the allow button. So, I strongly urge you not to do that. If you have done that by mistake, then your browser starts acting in a very unusual manner and you see a lot of intrusive ads. Now, let's fix the issue. First of all, let us do it manually. What you need to do is to go to this browser menu that looks as a circle in the form of three vertical dots. Click on Settings and now click on Site Settings. Then go to Notifications and check this Allow area carefully. Find this dangerous, uh, questionable website, click here and choose Remove. Finally, I also recommend that you additionally scan your Mac with the Combo Cleaner antivirus that you may get on this website combocleaner.com. Download the software, install it and uh, start it through your launchpad. The program will update its antivirus database and it has some free features by the way. Disk cleaner, big files, duplicates. These are free features to use, so you may enjoy them. However, the antivirus is the component of the premium license only. Nevertheless, it helps you perform a free analysis of your Mac when you click on Start Combo Scan button. So, the scanning by Combo Cleaner antivirus for Mac has been ended and now it's time to review the results. Check the antivirus area and click on the Review Results link. The report will display uh, each thread and will also show its location. So you may click on this icon to show the location of the thread in Finder and then you may right click on each specific thread and decide to move it to the trash. So you may do it with each specific thread manually by right clicking on the thread and moving it to the trash. Or you may do it automatically, however, only with the premium version of the program.